Hey guys, it's M here with a new video with Connection. Today I'll be explaining to you guys how to be a good ally to the 2S LGBTQIA plus community. There are seven main ways to being a good ally. Now I will explain to you guys each of these in more depth. The first one is to obviously educate yourself. Go educate yourself on the 2S LGBTQIA plus community on their history, struggles, and triumphs. There's always something new to learn, and there may and there are many resources to learn from, like Jeanne Sidem, Transkadin, if you go on the Connection website, we have lots of resources, and also on the Government uh, of Canada website. To stand against discrimination and erasure is to speak out online or in person, in person about it. Call out others that say discriminatory comments and actions. There is a lot of misinformations and stereotypes and misrepresentation that can cause this. 3. Confront your own prejudgments and biases. Be willing to face your own discomforts of addressing your own shortcomings. Reflect on your own assumptions and judgments and work on them to correct them. 4. State and ask pronouns. Get into a habit of stating and asking your pronouns, especially when meeting new individuals. It will avoid making incorrect assumptions. 5. Be open-minded. Listen respectfully to stories and experience of queer individuals. 6. Don't assume. Don't assume to know someone's gender or sexuality. D avoid defaulting to heteronormative and, and binary gender perception on others. And 7. Take action. Taking action is sharing information about politics, uh, donate to charity, uh, join advocacy groups and sharing information on social media. Taking action is the most important part to being an ally because if you don't try to make a difference, things will not get better for the community. So, yeah. I hope I helped you guys and I hope you will try to be a better ally yourself. Have a lovely day and I'll see you next time. Bye!